My name is Madison Abali, and I volunteer at the Riverside Sport Clinic. Today, I will be your guide through the CSMI Sportwear Technology. I will show you how to insert a new athlete, their injury, and their treatment. Let's get started. When you first access your internet browser, go to the top address bar and type in www.swol123.net and access. Once you reach the home screen of the CSMI Sportswear Online Technology, you will reach this home page. Access your account using your email and your password that were provided. Both email and passwords are case sensitive. This is your official home page for the software. Along the left hand side, you will find the database column. This is where you will go to enter any athlete injury, or treatment information. The first step is to click on the tab labeled Athlete. Once you have reached the Athlete homepage, you will see a list of all of the athletes currently entered from your school. If you need to enter an athlete who is not currently in your database, go to the right-hand side under a tab labeled Add. On this screen, you will enter the athlete's first name, last name, their graduating class, their gender, and their birth date. After this is completed, scroll down to the bottom right hand side and enter your athlete's sport. and their group, which is the school that they attend, the school that you are training at. Once this is completed, go to the top right-hand corner and select Save. Once the Save tab is selected, you will be returned to the athlete's specific home page. This will indicate that the athlete is officially entered into the CSMI Sportwear Online Database. Once you're at this screen, along the top, select the tab labeled Address. Once this tab is selected, a number of boxes will appear. However, the only box you will fill out on this page is the box labeled Zip Code on the left-hand side. After this is completed, go to the top right and once again select Save. After this is completed, select the fourth tab labeled Insurance. Once again, only one box will be completed on this page. Scroll down to the bottom left box labeled Policy and Information and select the box Type. This is a drop down menu where you, will, where you will select the insurance that your athlete has. After this is completed, go to the top right and select Save. Once this is completed, you are done filling out the athlete's general information. You will now select the tab on the left hand side under databases labeled injury. Because this is a new athlete, no injuries are inserted at this point. So go to the right hand side and select add. Once this injury menu is selected, this screen will appear. Insert your athlete's injury date, the trainer who assessed them, where they went for treatment, the body area that is injured, the specific body part that is injured, and the side of the body that the injury is located on. Once the three top boxes are completed, you are now free to move to the bottom boxes. Under the box labeled Injury 1, select the drop-down menu labeled Injury and select the specific injury your athlete possesses. Under Sight, select where the injury is. Under Severity, select the grade that your athlete's injury is. If this athlete has multiple injuries, the following injuries 
can be entered in the Injury 2 and Injury 3 boxes. When you are done completing this page, go to the top and select Save. An additional screen will appear with superfluous information on it. Again, click Save. Once Save is selected for the second time, you will return to your athlete's injury homepage. On this page, go to the top and select Background. On this page, you will be able to insert the mechanism of the injury, the onset, the level that the athlete plays at, the position the athlete plays, and if they were wearing any protection when the injury occurred. On the right hand side, select what activity was taking place at the time of the injury, what season they are in, where the injury took place, skip environment, and the surface the athlete was on when the injury occurred. Press save. You are now back to your athlete's injury homepage. You are done completing the injury portion of your athlete's database. Go to the left hand side and select treatment to input the treatment administered on the athlete. Because no treatment has taken place for this new injury, you will go to the right hand side and select add. You will select the injury that you are treating and press OK. You will then select the date that the athlete was treated on, skip time, the location where they were treated, what trainer treated the athlete, and then finally the treatment that was administered. Under this drop down menu you will find many treatments that are applicable to your athlete. Select all treatments that apply and when you are completed, click Save. After Save is selected, an additional screen will pop up. Click Save again without completing anything on that page. Congratulations! You have now successfully input a new athlete, injury, and treatment into your CSMI Sportwear Online database.